Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim I am Dr Muhammad Mahtab Alam and now I am going to explain uh, mean absolute deviation variance standard deviation and interquartile range so let's start with the IQR interquartile range in short it is called IQR interquartile range it is a range of value between the first and third quartile range of the middle half middle 50% useful when researcher are interested in the middle 50% values and not the extreme the formula for interquartile range iqr is q3 minus q1 for example for the cardiac patient in different countries of the world the iqr is this is q3 and minus this is q1 is equal to 19500 deviation from the mean useful for interval or ratio level data an ex examination of deviation from the mean can reveal information about the variability of the data deviation are used mostly as a tool to compute other measure of variability however the sum of deviation from the arithmetic mean is always zero this there are two way to solve this conundrum then mean absolute deviation mad one solution is to take the absolute value of each deviation around the mean this is called the mean absolute deviation for example this is the raw data given so how you can calculate mean absolute deviation so calculate mean and then uh, x minus mean uh, this is uh, x minus mean so uh, mean x bar is equal to sigma x by n so calculate mean so x bar is equal to 13 now x minus x bar this calculated and this is without sign x minus x bar or x minus m without sign so total total of this is 24 so mad is equal to sigma x minus mu under vertical bar divided by n so it is 24 by 5 so it is 8.4 note that while the mad is intuitively simple it is rarely used in practice 